Oh, wow. Oh, oh that's cool. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining us on this latest episode of Ride Through Commentary. And I'm Jason. I'm Steve. <laughs> I'm Jason. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm Pete. Yeah. I'm sick. <laughs> and you are not sick. <laughs> not sick. Yeah. <laughs> no, I do not have I, a virus. If you are sick, but... raise your hand. <laughs> I mean, Jason's getting over something, uh, but I'm, we're here. It, I might be sick in the head, but yeah, well, yeah, yeah, we're <laughs> that's dumb and different. Yeah, no, Jason, we're Jason's a little under yeah. the uh, the weather, but I, I am better. not under. You got it. through am, the intro. I'm we're proud of you. Through the mud, yeah. crawling through that mud, but you're doing good. And if, you're doing if good. you feel sorry for him, go ahead and like and subscribe yeah. to our channel. Like and subscribe <laughs> if you feel if you would like so Jason to get better. His name. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, what is your name? What is your name, sir? The, who, me? Yeah, you. Oh, my name's Jeff. Okay. So, yeah. Worse, <laughs> my name's... Well, I'm the goofy guy. Yeah. <laughs> the, the Jeff. And I'm Jeff. Just... Yeah. Jeff. Yeah. Oh, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my hey, name's if Jeff. You, uh, if you guys are new here, that's Jeff. He does goofy voices. Sometimes I do. <laughs> But if my voice here, is just uh, goofy, so yeah. Well, <laughs> mostly, yeah. Uh, there you have it. Tell him to shut up. Yeah. <laughs> that was mean. I hurt my feelings. Oh my gosh! I'm like, there you go. Uh, you know, I heard because I have. I can kind of hear it myself and. Well, that's funny because and... I can't hear. No. Yeah, yeah. But I'm like, oh gosh, I, that that was mean. So sorry, everyone. Yeah. I'm sorry for that. Uh, I, I'm, I'm used to it already. So <laughs> this is the longest intro ever. I know. All right. <laughs> oh, Welcome there. everyone. No, right. I'm just gonna say, if you are new here, please like and subscribe, turn on notifications, and share with your friends and family. As, As we, we have, have the video every week. Sometimes with this dude. Sometimes I, I might not be in it. Yeah. I was not, almost not in this one, but yeah, <laughs> we're all hit and miss is what you're yeah. trying to say. You know, you can't trust any yeah. of us. If uh, uh, barbecues, barbecues. Yeah, yeah. If, if, you, if you're okay with that, uh, like and subscribe. Yeah, there that's what go. we want to say. Done. So, right. uh, so what what we're at? Are we doing today, guys? Um, trying something new where we haven't been before, or no? Have we? Have we been there? I don't think we've had. I mean, I've been to Epcot once, but I've never been on this ride. No, I meant with our ride through. We never went to. I've never been to Epcot on a ride through. Hmm. We've wow. I don't think so. New territory. Y'all are yeah. a bunch of West Coasters. <laughs> yeah. And now yeah, we're like we've, mm -hmm. we've done uh, Animal Kingdom with Expedition Everest. Yes. And a couple and things from Walt Disney World, Walt Disney World. Magic Kingdom. But I don't think we did anything from Epcot. Yeah. Well, so this is our first time. Our first, uh, we're all yeah. virgins. Right. Through. Yep. It's time to break the seal, y'all. So what are we doing? We are doing Ratatouille. 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 For those who are new here, Jeff, <laughs> why don't you explain what we do? We ride. Rise. <laughs> Do we actually and ride then, them? I mean, in my heart, <laughs> With in my heart, I'm riding it. That's that's what makes okay. our ride through so emotional for me. All the time, we we ride. It's like <laughs> being with your best buddies, and you are just, you know, you skip the line. You skip the line. There's no genie pass here. Guess what? You're bam. You hit a button. You're with your buddies. You're you're going down, experiencing yeah. whatever ride we're, and then you get to talk about it while you're going through it yeah and, and, and it's like you know like mystery science theater style where you're just uh you're you're making jokes you know expressing your feelings whatever oh i like that or this oh look at look at the popcorn yeah. ceiling that looks like my apartment oh this what is what's up with this ride i don't know <laughs> you know maybe you're dis disenchanted maybe you're enchanted yeah. 
Yeah. Well, that's what this is all about, I think. It's about being with your buddies, going on. Hanging around. out. There's, there's times like, you know, I could be sitting on the comfort of my own couch at home. And I... Huh? Did you say under the comfort? No. I said on the... Did I? I may have. <laughs> I can't trust myself. <laughs> well, of course. Did I say that? Well, I don't even know. No. Anyways. So, <laughs> you could be on the couch. Cool. You could be on your own, your the comfort from your own right now for our listeners. You could be, you could get your exactly. seventy-five you inch television, crank up our podcast. You know, we can our and 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 just be be amongst friends, go through the ride, talk some smack to us. Just make sure you like and subscribe. Yeah. Say whatever the hell That's you want. That's all we want. No, I'm just kidding. Just subscribe. <laughs> I feel like we're going to just like slip in the like and subscribe every Everywhere. chance we get because we were talking yeah. about it before. The, like, you know, maybe once in a while we need to actually well, invite, you know, we are invite our channel. audience to like and subscribe. And we just, we're bad at that. So Please. this is going to be shameless. <laughs> Please. Please. Oh, Jessica. Oh, How do yeah, I love I thee? Yeah. I can't. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, I can't do it. I mean, I, that was horrible. You got to cut that out. No. <laughs> that was beautiful. Oh, yeah, this is LMG's new logo there. You know what I found out today? You know, Flan, which I always thought was a a, a cuisine from, yeah, Yeah. is actually French. Is it? Flan? Flan. And it's always, you know, you get Mexican food, you you order the dessert, you get the flan. So how the heck did that happen? What is, I don't know. Well, I, mean, what, I never actually had that. It's it's like it's like a custard with uh, caramel sauce. I was just saying, mm-hmm. uh, or like is it caramel? caramel. <laughs> I don't know anymore. Wow, this is pretty cool. This queue. So you're supposed to be in the restaurant. Is that what it is? The queue. Uh, well, this uh, is art. Guess, That's yeah, art because stuff. You're like in the kitchen, and then you. Yeah, but that's painting stuff. So. Uh, you got it. It's got to be some. I don't know why there's painting stuff. Was that a dog that just barked? <laughs> Are you, maybe you're in the museum in the beginning. <laughs> I don't know. But the ride you're going through the kitchen. Oh, they're showing. What's oh. that? Yeah, you're supposed to be going through. I, uh, I guess a kitchen. Well, you're Ratatouille, and he works in the kitchen. So, <laughs> when did this ride open? At well, the, at uh, uh, Epcot. A couple years ago. Okay, and it's a trackless ride, correct? Yeah. You know what I always thought was. Oh, oh 3D glasses. Yeah. Emergency exit. Oh wow, that's a small little mouse car. A uh, mouse car? That'd be a good is it, band name. Like a mouse little car. Mouse. Yeah. That, if I ever start a rock band, it's gonna be called Mouse Car. <laughs> See, it's a little mouse. Lord. Or is it supposed to be a rat? Because is isn't oh, a yeah. rat. Right? Yeah. Rat. Oh yeah. yeah. Rat car. Now, nah, I like mouse car better. Yeah. Well. So you're on the. Oh, you're supposed to be like on this on the roof. Yeah. The, oh, this is a nice ride. I, so this is yeah. one of those more experiential rides that tells a story. Yeah. You're not gonna. At least so far it is. <laughs> no, I don't speak French. Now you're going through an air vent. 
Oh, that's yeah. cool. Are, oh, how did they do that? Oh, it's 3D. It's, it's 3D. 3D. And it's, oh, yeah. So these are screens. Yes. Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Yeah, I love this. Yeah. Oh, I, I love, love this. <laughs> it's so cool. This is neat. So this is also like uh like the 4D. So like when you go under the oven, like you can feel the heat. Oh, you feel it? Yeah. yeah. You could feel the knife just whiz by like whiz, whiz by your face. With air. To me, what always gets me in that ex the 4D experience is air. When it puffs at like yeah. Indiana Jones, when it right. Pops. Oh. Beers going by. Yeah. The one that was the, the coolest uh, was Honey, I Shrunk the Audience, and the rats oh. run on your lap. No really way. Cool. Yeah. How cool. did they do that? I don't know. It felt like they were like running on your lap. It's, it's like vibrating the floor, but it. Oh. However, did it move your feet? Oh, that's right? pretty cool how they did. You'd like you're under the cart. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of my way. Uh, uh, not the sp uh, uh, homie. Yeah. I do not. I do not do the spinning uh, stuff. Oh my gosh! It's like the teacups oh, all oh, over yeah, again. Yeah. Oh, that is neat. This is what oh, Kenny. We were talking about with yeah. Kenny about having stuff above you. Yeah. Oh man. Go, go. Oh, you were here. Oh, wow, he's splitting up now. <laughs> Does everybody have their 3D glasses on? Yeah. Because <laughs> I don't. I don't. I don't think it would work for this anyway. Do you think they would work? Probably not. I don't think so. mm, maybe. Just to have Probably. different uh, polarization. Okay. I they even have the, the thread from the screw bolt. Oh, yeah. I see. Oh, yeah. It's from the screws. Yeah. Not the bolt. Screws. He's <laughs> fun. It's like a slide. Makes me want to watch the movie again. Uh, <laughs> I, yeah, me too. I forgot about his, that, that guy, the other rat, the, the goofy one. The what one? The goofy rat, his, his buddy. The goofy one? Did you say the goofy one? <laughs> well, I thought I heard you right. <laughs> Turns out I did. <laughs> okay. How many of these little rats do they have? Cars, rat cars. Really a cars. bunch I so wonder if they tilt too when they're going down those hills and stuff. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. Sure it, it, and watch your step I can't right. tell with the Goodbye. under underneath the the car. But you're you're on this giant platform. It must. Go yeah, I mean, you, so you would think of it. It could do this. <laughs> Someone just throws it. <laughs> Is that what happened? Oh, maybe it was the hat. Why that did somebody funny. just toss that? Like, yeah. oh, I don't care. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Cool. See you later. Goodbye. Was it raining? That was pretty cool. That looks like it's raining. Is it? Oh, it's it's Florida. I like those kind of rides. I think those are yeah, just that was cool. fun. And that one was a great one where 
it was still exciting, but it wasn't, you know, it was exciting, but it was, you know, those are good rides that, it was like, you know, before, it was fun. Yeah. yeah, and before, like, you go in the big ones, you know, sometimes you go, it's a palate cleanser in a sense, but not a bad one, you know, it's not yeah, like, no, oh, we got, we've no. got to go to Disney so we can ride the, the Ratatouille ride, <laughs> like, no, nobody, nobody yeah. would do that, but <laughs> you would hop on that ride and be like, well, that was really cool, okay, well, what do you all want to do next, well, maybe we... Now go get a you know something to eat, and then then we're gonna go ride whatever it is. This one of the big ones, and and I think I think Was these Star rides. Spaceship uh, Earth. Yeah. Well, they also have uh, Guardians. What do you call it? Uh, cosmic Rewind. Oh, Cosmic Rewind. That's over at Epcot. Yeah. Oh. That's pretty um, much their only. It's like why would that be Cosmic Epcot. Rewind? <laughs> What's the one in Disneyland at, that? Overtook the terror of tower, what the tower of terror, the, uh, mission breakout, mission, mission breakout. Oh, yeah. that one's cool. I love that one. It's like being invited to a nightclub, <laughs> and all your yeah. and all your friends <laughs> works for Nick Fury. <laughs> You're like, so what? Mm, what mm, what mm, land is is or do they have lands at Epcot? I don't I don't know Epcot. So they, I mean, they they have uh, like World Showcase and. So I understand no. Ratatouille is in the French part because of yeah, well that's in right. the pavilions. So where where does Guardians fit in? It it took over, um, took over the Ellen ride, which El- Ellen Ellen had a what was it called um, Universe of Energy or something? I you know, I never went on it, so it was like a dinosaur ride, and you went. Through um, hmm. dinosaurs, Stuff. <laughs> she's like, I, I never went on it, so I'm not. Yeah, I'm not I, don't, a, I don't know. I don't know. This is more of a Kenny, that. so yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. but there's Kenny, there's Kenny different traveling. stuff out there. They have um, they have that restaurant. Um, what's it called? Two twenty or something? Space restaurant where you go to go up in the elevator. Oh, hmm. that one. Yeah, I saw. Uh, who was it? Ordinary Ventures. They did a a, a video on that. They have the uh, was Mission to Mars, but it's like a updated version. Yeah, it's like a simulator or whatever. But like it's oh, like Star Trek. Yeah, yeah and no, then that's all right. I, it's like it's right right there is where huh. Guardians is. It's like all you know, updated space stuff. Hmm. I don't know if that hmm. would be considered Future World. Uh, they changed the names so. though. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. I'm not too familiar with that, the whole area over there. So yeah. Well, I mean, I thought I knew, but now they completely changed everything. So well, guys, just go it. go watch Mickey Views. I'm sure he'll explain it all because he does a pretty good job over there. Mickey yeah. Views. Yeah, Mickey Braden. Views. Oh. Yeah, he's good. Let me go. Let me go now. He, he's uh <laughs> Mickey. All these people you name drop, I'm like, wait, I don't. I don't... He, he's like only in his twenties, and uh, he's been doing this since he was like eleven. Yeah, he's probably he's really earlier. He, he well, started well, like, well, like, like like Chris too. LMG Vids. He's been doing it since. Wow, what? Also like LMG 2010, Vids. Video like machine gun. I oh, know. Okay, subscribe. Man, I'm learning that, that's our buddy. That's our buddy. Did Chris. Goofy say that? Wait, hold on. What? Th- there's a thing. It's like, what did Goofy just say? Hold on. I gotta see the hair. Ah. <laughs> so, what? What was your the part that you liked the most of of the Ratatouille? If you had to choose one section, honestly, um, I don't know if there's like one section. The whole ride was just like a constant go, go, go. Well, so, in the beginning, you stop at that. And you watch for a little while the whole thing that's, that's yeah. I mean, it's true, but like yeah. most of the ride, though, you're yeah. kind of just going and going. You're moving around. So that's kind of yeah. cool. There wasn't like a mm-hmm. there's no downtime. Like I, I actually even, go, yeah. Go, go ahead. ahead. No, no. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go. Oh, so I'll go. <laughs> so what I liked, everybody. Yeah. Yeah. What I liked, uh, I liked the pacing of it because I thought it was. You know, if you think about what is the story of this ride, you know, you want it to kind of invoke a little bit of uh, disease, you know, because that's the feeling of being a dang rat. 
Always, <laughs> someone's always in a yeah. restaurant, always trying, to, someone's always after you. You know, you always got a target on your back for some reason. So I thought the pacing was fitting for the story. Uh, I thought I really like, I'm a big fan of, of uh, rides and things that put you in the perspective of whatever it's like you are a right. character and and exactly. it, i think i think those kind of rides are great for empathy they're empathy building rides because it forces you to think you know to see a world not only through your eyes but now you're suddenly forced to see the eyes through the eyes of somebody else and i think that Correct. is good for kids and for us even as adults it helps yeah. us to say you know in my day-to-day -day life you know, maybe I need to stop and think of how the world looks through the eyes of somebody other than myself. And I think that rides like this are good, good training. And, and they kind of, even for kids and adults, where, where um, you know, it, it sort of makes us do that. And I think, I, I don't know right. how else no, to say yeah, more. Yeah. But I, but no, I think, and yeah, I think that's a I, good thing. I think that's a very good of thing. Course, so yeah. that's what I liked. Yeah. yeah. The, well, the, the only was, thing... <laughs> you, you. you go ahead you, you first go ahead, go ahead. Uh, no i was just say, i was, one, so I was trying ahead. to compare it to uh mickey's and mini <laughs> mickey's and minnie's runaway <laughs> railway because there's a lot yeah. of like catching up to the train or just departing and then yeah. going to the daisy thing and dancing oh yeah there wasn't like, like a, a movement of it yeah. yeah i mean you're you're maybe constantly moving but it, it's kind of like the story was breaking off here and there yeah this one just kind of seemed like it kept going. That's, that's yeah, kind of, and I think that's kind of the experience. Yeah, I, see, and I could I agree with you there. Like it could have been you could have had like a sudden ease and been like, oh, okay, here's the moment. To, oh no! And then it's like this is the nervous, crazy experience. You know, these moments of highs and lows. I don't know. It seemed right, like that one right. was just very. You know, it's like listening to a, a song that's only the chorus. And not having the the verses and the bridge oh, yeah, and yeah. all yeah. these necessary. Yep. You went down that hill and then they blew you back away. Yeah, that kind of reminded <laughs> me of Expedition Everest when you go backwards. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. This one felt very like evenly paced, and that that yeah. could be that could be for its benefit, but it also could not be because if it's if you just want a high strung ride, and it wasn't high high strung. Like but yeah, I mean it, it kept no, going, no. but I don't think it it wasn't going very fast or anything. So no, but no. I just think there, there was just. There was no downtime except for yeah, like the beginning. Or yeah, you want to be taken on a, a journey, and yeah. and we can all I can go back into the modern storytelling thing that I just I f I feel like we miss these peaks and valleys a lot in modern storytelling. Probably this is probably how we construct rides too, where where a lot of times we, you know, we think if we're on a constant high. Being in a nightclub, like that's what everybody wants. It's like, well, you know, sometimes when you don't have that moment of ah, taking a breath and a pause, it makes the highs higher, you know. And 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 so I don't I don't know if this ride I'd have to go. Th I'd have to actually ride I, it. I, and, I would love to you know, ride. Yeah. To, yeah. Me too. Me too. The one that I, that I, I I thought be, was cool was how the like Jason was saying how it's like a kind of more of a a lot like a 4d but you feel stuff yeah. happen around you like that apparently when that that part was cool when you're under the oven mm -hmm. and then the, the you know the pilot light and all the and i like the the oven under the oven. turns on yeah yeah, yeah that, i think you also uh, smell you, i guess you feel the heat too. yeah the, the only thing i, oh, I don't smell know cheese I, is that what you said yeah 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 <laughs> the only the only thing in this the thing I don't like. Well, I, I've never ridden it, so I can't really say. Mm -hmm. But I but I can say from experience of riding rides like this is I don't like the wearing the glasses. I don't like the three D okay. part of it. And, yeah, and I think was, that's where Mickey's and Minnie's and that, Runaway Railway right. you know exceeds because it's they, got yeah the you don't need glasses projected and, stuff that's projected. Right. Don't want no freaking but glasses. But I, 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 I think they I think in this case the glasses make it more mm. real I guess that mm -hmm. you're small I don't know I I'm I, that's my guess but uh, mm. I rather I rather not wear glasses if they can do it without making it 3d well, they always are distractingly 3d glasses even in a movie theater 
Yeah, when it, you they're... see a movie with 3D glasses, you're like, ow, ow, why is it so prickly? Why does it feel yeah. so? It's, no, it's, I, I get it's, I can't like, eyes. eyes. I have to like rub my eye. I have to take the glasses off and rub my eyes yeah. and and well, the, everything yeah, and put it they, on. And by that time, like, why are these glasses missed, so I missed, sharp? Like ten seconds. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm checking myself to see if I'm bleeding. You know, I'm like, ah, yeah. why? <laughs> when they manufacture these glasses, like you think they have some sort of system where they sand down these hard edges because like <laughs> I feel like I'm just checking yeah. for blood halfway through <laughs> the Avengers. You know, go through quality Crazy. control very good. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's funny. I don't know, that's just my little two cents with the three D. Wasn't uh, wasn't James Cameron I mean, trying to figure out a way to do it without the glasses? I have no idea. We may, you mean like probably a three D regular, regular falling, movie or this? Yeah. yeah, I mean it should work for anything really. Uh, it's yeah, just, I mean I had a because conversation. Look, look, with, at, look at Pirates of Shanghai. Sorry, Jeff. Look at oh, Pirates ahead, of Shanghai, at Shanghai. You don't need 3D glasses, but look how right. immersive that that ride is. And that's that's you know, where even it has with... all the screens and stuff. So yeah, use them anyway. It's 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 the same kind yeah. of thing because it has the protections, but then it has yeah the animatronics with it. Right. So if right. everything was in the back on this ride, that was projection, but then you had like characters. Yeah, you wouldn't need that either. Three but... D is historically always they've been trying to push it and push it and push it, and they people come. They, it always circles back and they tried it and it doesn't work out. Like, remember the big 3D TV things? Like, I was just, what I was yeah. going to say, Sam, Steve, Samsung, yeah, yeah, sorry. And yeah. Steve-O, what I was going to say was like, we, uh, or I had a conversation with a friend the other day and he still has his 3D. It's like a 3D, was it Samsung? Is that what you just said? Yeah. I still have one. It's yeah. an LG. Samsung. Or LG. Yeah. I, mean, yeah. I, don't, I don't know what it is. So the, but, one, the one that we have was a Samsung TV and a Samsung. Uh, okay. Blu-ray, 3D, yeah. the plate. But 3D he's had disc. that TV as long as I've known him. That was back in 2017 <laughs> or before. So he he got it before that. But he holds yeah. on to that thing, and he's invested so much in these 3D movies, and he's got his glasses, and right. and I think that's great. I'm sure it's. I would love to. I probably would do the same. So I'm not. I'm not ragging on him at all. But what I would say is, well, why don't they make them anymore? It's like, well, there's just something kind of annoying about having to put yeah. on your glasses and, well, and then they, they have a you have to turn them on too so you have oh, to charge yeah. them and everything. Yeah. Well, see, that's, that's the thing there's there's other ones that have different polarization so it flips between every other screen mm -hmm. every other yeah. frame rather yeah and then your glasses are different polarized so it hmm. triggers it just like a red and blue see, i think maybe that's what's bugging my eyes <laughs> Something I, 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 and I'm not saying this stuff's not cool. I just say people are. I think we're a lot oh, no, easier yeah. as a species I, I, than we I think, think it's we cool. are. <laughs> like yeah. I don't want to put this <laughs> on my face. No way. It, That's not it's a cool no. idea. No. Yeah, and and it is, and it is. But it's like it takes work, and you have to kind of be invested in the three. And here's my glasses. Now I got to charge. Well, what I got to charge these things? Ah, stupid. Can't we just? And so I think I think you know the the complaint about this ride. Being like, ah, oh, it's 3D. I was just, uh, 3D. I'm like, okay, that's, you know, that's okay, fair. So like, that's fair. You know, I the, understand the, that. Like, um, PlayStation has the VR stuff and, yeah. and Oculus. That's why whatever, that hasn't right? taken off either. That's the why. Yeah, because, like, why aren't we just like, yeah. why isn't this, you know, um, like, uh, Ready Player you, you One? Get bored of it. It's and we're not thing. Because, well, it's heavy. It's uncomfortable. I don't want to put crap on my face. Now, if it was just a regular pair of glasses that was. I think the only now this is when this I'm just I'm gonna say it here, everybody. <laughs> this is when I think really, you know, AR, VR, whatever it is, will just take off. When you're down the road and you're looking around and people just like like doing this, like in some other world. Well. And we're all in, we're not in reality anymore. It's not when like Ready Player One, where you have these big goggles or those yeah. new Apple yeah, yeah. things. Right. No, man. It'll it's be, when it, it'll it is be like an echo, an echo. Where it'll be like when you contacts, contact contacts. Yeah. Yes. Or just a yeah. light, easy breezy sunglasses like that doesn't feel any different than the sunglasses you put on anything more yeah. until they get people get to like that technology. Now, you would think with, you know, because that's exactly what um, 3D glasses are. It's just like, well, it's really light. You just put them on. But yet yeah. people still don't want to do that. And so I don't I don't know why, but all I know historically is that, you know, 3D is like it comes back and it 
tanks. It comes back, it tanks. So, and so there, there was a um, a place in downtown Disney, mm -hmm. in um, uh, called the Void, yeah. and you would wear the big gold glasses or headset or whatever. Yeah, and it was a whole Star Wars thing where it's all VR experience. Yeah, and that lasted. I don't know, maybe a couple of years and yeah. it's gone, you know? It, yeah. Interesting. So it's like it, it, it has a high point and then once it reaches that point and then everybody's like, eh, forget it. I feel it, people are know? just always disenfranchised with, with either VR or, and, and, and same with 3d. Yeah. And I don't know why, like, I like, I like the experience, but even in, when I see 3d movies, like it always seems a little fake to me. Like it, you know. Yeah, yeah it looks. Yeah. But it, they, like, people, <laughs> like the characters, always seem smaller. Honestly, you know, it is. It's, I love yeah. seeing three D movies, but it, it it is an it's an odd experience. It's not quite right. You know, it's it's not it's, like um, I'm actually there. It yeah. does feel sort yeah. of fabricated, and and I don't think everybody because likes I, I that. saw a Marvel. I can't remember which Marvel movie it was that I saw in three D. And yeah. then I saw it in regular, and yeah. I liked the regular version better mm -hmm. <laughs> than yeah, the 3D experience. Yeah, yeah. I'm actually like all that. So I'm I, number one. Everything I said could be completely wrong. Uh, if you no, think no, I'm an idiot, and idiot. then <laughs> hey, comment below, like, subscribe, and push back on me. I have no problems with that. I think that's you know. What, what do you all think? millions of viewers yeah. um comment but, below and tell Jeff. comment below like and subscribe uh but <laughs> i also i you know i may maybe i don't know i i will say i'm being a little cr critiquey but i actually really like no, 3d I, I, it's not I a like big that. deal to me but i you know right. putting myself through the eyes of other people i could sort of see why 3d and things like you know the big vr because this, stuff just doesn't I, I believe um i believe um star tours is still 3d yeah. I'm not. I'm not sure if it is or not, but I think it is. Right, Star Tours yeah. in Disneyland. Yep. And then Captain EO so, is still. I mean, that's been going for years, and that's yeah. still 3D. So I yeah. mean, like, <laughs> hey, I mean that's, see, that 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 alone. Been, yeah. Captain that EO was, is still there, right? Like it's by the Tiki no, Room. Everybody. There. Oh yeah, yeah. What? So Wait, what? Yeah. Of course. No. Yeah. yeah. It's in the Jungle what? Cruise, and <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, guys. Yeah. Well, but back then, the technology back then, when okay. Captain EO first came out, that was that was great. Yeah, but yeah. like, honey, I shrunk the audience. I don't remember if if that was three D or not. I don't remember wearing glasses. Mm. It's been a while. That one was, was it three D. I thought it was three D. It may have been three. It, it was four D. Well, the Muppet, the Muppet one was three D. The Muppet Show yeah. in California Adventure, mm -hmm. uh, that was three D. Okay. Do you guys follow um, Casey Neistat? Yeah, a little uh, bit. Who? Casey Neistat. He's, he's like, like the biggest no. YouTuber in, well, almost, in the history. But... He's like the biggest YouTuber on the planet. I think planet. that would be Mr. Beast. Uh, oh, yeah, I have no idea really who that is. Know. Sorry. Mr. Beast has like over 100 million subscribers. Okay. Anyway. Oh, uh, that's the guy you were telling me. Okay. I know you are talking about. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're the one that told um, me about that. But Casey Sorry. had the... Uh, <laughs> The Apple, what do you call it, Vision yeah, Pro, whatever. Mm -hmm. yeah. He just walked around New York wearing them, yeah. showing it from his point of view and stuff. Yeah, and it's pretty yeah. awkward. <laughs> Is it awkward? I, I'm, I mean, yeah. he, he was able, to, like, he wore it like all day, and just he had extra batteries, and he wore it for like eight hours. Okay. And like he was doing <laughs> stuff, and he would stop, and, and people would be like staring at him, we're like, "What the hell are you doing?" Did he show what, like he, what he was he like? Has a virtual afterwards? keyboard? Huh? What did he say? show what he was like after? He, he showed it. He had some guy filming no, at, him, and he know, showed it from his after, point of view. I know, but after you mean like he, was he disoriented? He after he took it off, yeah. Was he? How was, was he? Like, he, after he took it off. No, he he no, 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 this yeah, but this one's different see. because you can still see reality, oh, okay. but it's, it's it's more AR than it is VR, at least in that. So when you're walking, oh okay, yeah, so yeah, it's, it's weird augmented, because when when you stop, you can put up a window. And a keyboard, and like you can type, but when you walk, oh, wow. that stays there. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. okay. So, like, you have to, like, have to I don't know any, I, I, I've never heard of it. When I can buy that in the form yeah. of contacts from a gas station, that's when 
Yeah. yeah, I will. Well, and that's what everybody's saying is like until this is like a glass or you can have a contact, then from a gas cares? station, yeah. it's got to come from a gas. We, station. we have to wait for or a um, vending machine. Right, <laughs> it's got to cost like a nickel. Uh, shoot, what was his name now? I forgot it, his name. it won't cost a nickel. I don't even know if they make those anymore. Yeah. <laughs> shoot, what was that guy's name now? The the big guy from um, Echo, and he was in um, the Marvel. What, his real name or no? The character name Kingpin. Kingpin. There we go. So Kingpin made made Echo that the little uh, yeah little I... contact lens with the oh yeah. With the sign language thing it built yeah. in, be so we cool. need we need a bunch of kingpins to to make to make those. Contacts. That's why I only make friends with people in high places, places. of crime, low, low people in high places, or high people in low places. No, <laughs> kingpin would be I don't know I don't know what he's a low person, <laughs> <laughs> or he's a high person in low place. <laughs> Anyway, well, thanks for watching, well, everybody. <laughs> on that note, there was something else after this mission, but I can't, I can't remember what it was now. It probably wasn't worth uh... repeating. Oh, I know what it was. <laughs> yeah. Besides the um, Apple Vision or whatever, you guys saw the uh, things that Disney came out with? Well, one of their Imagineers. He made the ground that you can walk on and stay in one place. Oh, that's no. cool. So it's, it's got a, it's like a little treadmill thing. It, think of like tiny little treadmills that are controllable and they can go in any direction. Oh, neat. Oh, that's huh. cool. So, so that like is like walk. ready player one sort of yeah, thing. Yeah, you can walk and, nice. and you can have multiple people wow. on the same thing. Oh, you I'm can turn impressed. around and walk that direction. You can turn this direction. My goodness. But it's also you, controllable. You they can actually put a, something on there and move it around. Yeah. Oh. See, that's cool. That is like close. To, ooh, we're, we are one step. You got Apple doing its thing. You got that thing. Now put those things together. I may never leave my closet. So, so that means yeah. that is, is, you're saying that Apple is going to buy Disney? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, Musk. I mean, yeah. Yeah. anyways, <laughs> yeah. no, but th like they were talking about, like, you know, they, they don't know what they're going to do with it yet, but yeah, but think but about if that on was it? on one stage with a whole bunch of people, like you could have sets moving around itself or yeah, that would change. Anything. That could change a lot. That yeah, can you change. Can, you could, How big is this thing? That's the thing. I mean, you can, if you made it as big as the stage, you can do whatever you want. But right now they just that could be a whole ride. You can walk like people. instead of being in a cart. And during a ride, like you could, you could just walk through. Like here's your walkthrough ride now. Let me get a clip. We'll just show it really fast. Yeah, yeah. I, I'd like okay, to see that. that yeah, me too. I'm thinking one because you were like, oh, it's is this big? So well, I'm like, the, the, the little do? things on the ground and are a whole bunch together. Interesting. Hi, hi. <laughs> That's what you sound like. <laughs> who who does? Who who does who does I sound? No I don't have no idea. Oh, he does. Yeah. Yeah. Shows. Yeah, listen. Come on in. Hmm. Hey, how are Hi. you? Hi. Oh. Hi. <laughs> oh, Hi, guys. Good to see. No, I'm not making fun. He's this is the guy who made the floor, by the way. <laughs> He's also the guy who made the lightsaber, telescoping lightsaber, and all that shit. This guy's awesome. Yeah. No, he is. He just won a uh I forgot what the award was. You're not subscribed uh, to Disney Parks. Do you see this, everybody? <laughs> I don't remember the award, but oh, he's, he's, the only, he's not signed in. He's the only person oh, in the okay. whole Disney company except for Walt Disney to win this award. Wow. Really? It's like for you know, making stuff better for it's like he won the Walt Disney. Disney Award. Walt didn't even win that award. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait a minute. The hollow tile right. floor. Let's do so, it. Yeah, let's go. Come on. So this is the hollow tile. It is. And oh as God. a matter of fact, I'm going to do a little demonstration of it. So I can walk on this on the <laughs> wow. direction floor wow. in any direction I want. 
it will no. automatically do whatever it needs to have me stay on the floor. And what's amazing about this is multiple people can be on it and all walking independently. They can walk in virtual reality and Gosh, so many other things. Cool. So where so are you hoping this tech little ball bearings. You know, imagine yeah. a number of people being in a room, being able to be somewhere else collaboratively and moving around, seeing, doing sightseeing. Imagine theatrical stages that might have these uh, embedded in them so that dancers can do amazing moves. Not me, but <laughs> really good dancers. Um, so there are just so and many applications like for yeah, this and type that's how of they technology. Built the what if the, this could be ironic? <laughs> what if you're like in a digital like VR nightclub and really you're very next to like, if you were in real life to bump into this woman and she would just be the perfect match, the love of your life, but instead she's out like, you know, a hundred miles this way right. in VR life and you're a hundred miles that way. But really in real life, <laughs> you were just an elbow bump away. Yeah. Well, I mean, apparently you can just Lost turn your love. head and she would have been there, right? See, I'm always thinking of the downside to technology. No, that was cool though. <laughs> that was actually really cool. That is cool. Yeah, they're yeah, like, I mean, like I, coated, uh, like, uh, like rubberized ball bearings or something. Yeah, I mean, it's amazing. Can, that was impressive. You can hear them. I mean, it sounded yeah, like you can hear it rolling. Yeah. So, so it reminded me, um, it, the old, um, calculators from way back when I forgot what they're called. They're on a, a, like a block and they have the little beads where you slide them up, but those beads are, yeah, the, uh, um, <laughs> um I forgot what they're called, but that's <laughs> yeah. called. But that's what that reminded me of because I used to always I had my dad's and I used to yeah. always put something on it and I can roll it around without um, the thing moving. Yeah. Abacus or something? Abac or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's what it was called. Abacus. Something like that. Yeah. But yeah, you move the beads across. I did yeah. thought that was so cool though. I was I mean, I can think of a, somebody you know, getting stuff done that's what i yeah. that's what i'm I thinking i think of a, a hundred different ways you could probably use that but vr is oh, all yeah. you know, the most yeah yeah so you don't have funny videos of people running into their tvs and right stuff. right <laughs> i mean i don't see anybody running on that but I'm, i imagine it must be possible yeah oh but yeah I'm wearing, but I, adapts to you? I can actually see it used for like the automotive you know, you drive your car on it and because you, you have those um, dyna dynameters or what, I think that's what they're called. Oh, where to, you uh, test your speed and all that. And yeah, yeah. Oh, dinos. So, they're just called dinos. Yeah. yeah. So you can. Well, you know, I mean, also like your car stalls on the road. You, if a road's built out of these things, it will just move it out of the way. And I will... Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah, but if the whole cool, road though. is made out of that, you're not going to go. Yeah, but anywhere. I could run. I could do my martial arts. I could break dance fight. Whatever I want to do. Could I just I run get my on my knees and go like forever? <laughs> yeah, you could. And then you if want. you put so electricity you. into that, <laughs> well, I, I would, there has to be because right. it, it can move stuff around. So there's got to be electricity. Mm -hmm. Well, I, no, it doesn't have to. If they're made of all ball bearings inside, if you place the heavy object or an object onto those and you can just push it because yeah. all the yeah the, but the, it was moving that itself he was it sitting was. on his like a ball yeah, it, it responds yeah, yeah, to right. you yeah. and your movement so it's yeah. pretty smart so it's it's doing whatever you do it's there to like no so it was specifically moving. moving him around it was okay. moving him in a circle so it is he he wasn't controlled. doing nothing it can move you, yeah. you around and it, you can also move around on it okay. all right well, okay. he right. probably has a rem there's probably a remote that connects to each or those pads, Maybe. right? And if it you still we'll find out, we'll find this, out. How about like that? that force <laughs> motion. Yeah. Right. Right now, I'm like, I don't know. Because I was it, thinking, is if there, if, can if, I yeah, lay on it and go to sleep? Because that's how I feel right now. <laughs> yeah, it's, but it's it's going to be like slowly rolling you off, and then you're going to be like, boop. <laughs> yeah. I know. Because if it's uh, if they have it on a road and it's magnetic or running through electricity or whatever and the vehicle has the the opposite right so if it's a magnetic as it's positive what if, what one the and then it's it can just propel you through what the whole if the thing. whole a whole queue line was made out of that you got a lot of people falling down no i mean like <laughs> you don't actually have to move you're like hey we just oh move yeah, you along. yeah wow it's gonna be like uh uh what was the name of that movie now <laughs> 
I can't remember this. But no, no, I was just thinking it's kind of like the new version of those uh, flat escalators, the, the rubber those things walkways. like an airport or whatever. Yeah, yeah. 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 So on the Haunted Mansion exit has that too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a moving right. walkway. Yeah. And on that note, like, subscribe, share it for the family. Let us know how we're doing. Wally, that's the movie. <laughs> <laughs> what about it? Just kidding. <laughs> All right, okay. everybody. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining us. We will see you on the next one. Bye, everybody. Ha, ha, ha.